In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can configure advanced level configuration on your Jellyfin server. Hello and welcome back to my channel. So in my last video, I showed you how you can install Jellyfin free media server on your Linux server. So this is going to be the second part of that video. So I copied these two movies just for example. And uh, right now I'm logged in as just a user. So let's uh, go to the administration panel and let me show you step by step. So once you click on the dashboard, so it's going to show you something like this. So here you can restart your uh, server, you can shut down and uh, also if you update some files in your folder, you can just scan all libraries. And if uh, you're using Windows computer to copy the files, I have created another video. Uh, you can see that to like to minimize your efforts on copying file using another third party software like winscp or filezilla you can just directly access the folder on your uh, windows machine and just copy directly so click on the link above if you want to see that video okay let's get back to this one so here it's showing your server details so this is the server name and the version and the activity which is going on and the paths uh, it's using okay so under general you can see the server name we can change this whatever we want and uh, this is the cache path you can change that as well and uh, there is a custom css code if you want you can use that too so under users you can create as many users as you want so i just created talha as user and this one jellyfin is the administrator under libraries you create uh, the media library like i created one uh, under the name of movies and if you want to create a new one you can choose any of those like mixed movies and shows music videos photos books whatever you want and here you can set the display name and this is the uh, point where you select the folder so here you can select the folder uh, like right now it's in the root folder and uh, if you go to boot and grub what wherever you want to go or if you want to go to root you can see all the directories here uh, the vr usr temp so you can use any of that directory to get your files okay so the next one uh, sorry i have to go back to get rid of this okay so under playback you can see the transcoding uh, if you know about that you can uh, edit that otherwise just keep this as it is and uh, under devices you can see how many devices are connected to this server so i actually installed jellyfin application on my iphone so here you can see it's showing uh, mobile phone ios and this is the application version so that's also super easy you just need to go to app store and type jellyfin and under servers you need to type the whole address as 10.0.0.130 and the port number as well so i'm showing you for my server but if you want to change this to a website or you want to change the port number you can do that too so we will do that in the advanced networking mode and under activity you can see what's going on uh, who is logged in who is doing what and uh, then there is a live tv if you guys have any data from provider you can do that as well and under networking so here is the local port number what we are using so you can change that to whatever you want and you can also enable https depending on uh, your uh, SSL certificate so here you can uh, put your SSL certificate and the certificate password and uh, once you select the required HTTPS but this one is the test machine so I'm just using HTTP and you can use bind to a local network address as well and here is going to be your URL like example.com or your base URL and other than that you can uh, filter any ip addresses and you can block ip addresses what you don't want to uh, get into your server okay after that we have the api key feature as well uh, you just need to click on plus sign and mention your api and uh, under the logs you can see uh, the logs here 
and uh, notifications so it shows like what happens on an uh, this server uh, like plugin failed plugin installed whatever is going on with this server it shows here and under plugins you can see uh, we have uh, like five plugins audio DB music brands and more and there are repositories if you wanna uh, select more repositories to get more plugins and uh, there is a catalog you can search from catalog as well but it all depends what you want on this server all right guys thank you so much for watching the video and this was uh, the second part of jellyfin and uh, let me know in the comments if you want to know anything more about this uh, i would be so happy to share my knowledge with you and uh, make sure you like the video and subscribe the channel thank you so much i will see you in the next video bye bye